All across the world are strange myths. Some of these spread through a town or region like wildfire and have sparked various tales and legends. So today, here at Unexplained Mysteries, we take a look at three mysterious creatures. The Orang Minyak Referred to by Malaysian locals as the Orang Minyak, a name of which roughly translates to mean the oily man, there appears to be a supernatural entity capable of invading homes throughout the night. This happens all across the country and has caused a terrible amount of havoc. Oddly, some locals have said that different people seem to attract the creature. The legend of the Orang Minyak claims that the supernatural entity was first created by an evil group of Bomo, the name in the region that refers to witch doctors. They're said to create the creature for the purpose of causing fear and chaos to as many people as possible. The creature supposedly looks like a normal man, with the exception that he's able to cover his entire body with a black, oily substance. This strange substance pours out of its sweat glands and makes him nearly impossible to see at night. This oil also seems to serve as a defence mechanism. Those that attempt to grab him find that he's impossible to hold down. This is due to the oil being slippery to hold on to. The strange ability is what leads the Orang Minyak to hide during the day and only prowl the country at night. This is in an effort to remain unseen by using the dark cloak of the oil dripping from his body to blend into the night. The most terrifying part of the legend surrounding that of the Orang Minyak is the constant reports. Various locals are still telling their story of having run into with the creature. According to witness reports taken back in 2005, there had been an Orang Minyak holding a weapon and running around the halls of a hospital. This was while attempting to hold down fleeing nurses. Before authorities could arrive, the supernatural entity had already vanished. Additionally, another report of the creature that gained popularity was made back in 2012. This was when numerous reports poured in from a small village. People had claimed that they had seen one of these creatures prowling the street. From eyewitness stories, the creature seems to go for women more. Various photographs and videos have been taken of the creature. Most of them show what appears to be a black mass. It's said that they're not scared of going inside someone's home, and if that someone does find themselves with one of these creatures nearby, the only thing they can do is run. The Bucket Timar Monkey Man is believed to be a primate that lives in the jungles of Singapore. According to the local legends, this forest-dwelling creature is immortal and has been living in forests for hundreds of years. The mysterious creature was first reported by the Japanese soldiers during World War II. Soldiers reported seeing mysterious humanoid-like creatures in the jungles. They described them as being smaller than a human, but being very hairy. Over the years, a number of local residents have since reported seeing the creature. The most recent alleged sighting of the Monkey Man was in 2007. All the alleged sightings of the creature have been in and around the Bucket to Mar Rainforest. The creature is believed to be 3 to 6 feet in height and it walks on its hind limbs. Bucket to Mar Nature Reserve is home to thousands of monkeys and researchers believe that there's a possibility that the crab-eating macaque monkeys could be at times mistaken for the Monkey Man. However, the biggest difference between the description of the Bucket to Mar Monkey Man and the crab-eating macaque monkeys is their size. For the last 10 years, people have reported seeing the Monkey Man, and a few years back, a 48-year-old taxi driver reported seeing the elusive creature. According to the taxi driver, he was driving his taxi near the fire station located on the upper Bucket to Mar Road late at night, when he suddenly hit a strange creature that was running in the middle of the road. It looked like a very large monkey. The creature got injured as a result of the accident, however, shortly after, it ran off into the forest and wasn't seen by the man again. Various sources state that the man drove off after hitting the creature. However, the next morning, tyre marks could be seen where the car had braked. It was suggested that whatever was hit by the vehicle did survive and managed to find shelter in the nearby forest. Another recent encounter with an alleged monkey man was reported by a 29-year-old woman. One cold, foggy morning, 
she was walking towards a bus stop when she saw someone near a rubbish bin. When she approached, the creature made a loud animal sound and ran into the forest. She described the creature as grey, hairy, walking like a human but having a monkey's face. The woman immediately called the police. However, the creature had vanished into the jungle and wasn't able to be relocated. A number of stories relating to Monkey Man sightings have also appeared in local media. However, researchers are still confused about the mysterious sightings of the Monkey Man and what it could possibly be. Another strange case involving that of a Monkey Man occurred in India. According to witness accounts, the Monkey Man was originally spotted around the city of New Delhi during 2001. People had been attacked by this mysterious creature. The legend tells in detail that the strange creature was seen climbing walls, posts and the side of buildings. This was whilst leaping to and from tall structures at an almost supernatural speed. The creature was described as being around 4 foot tall, covered in thick black hair and wearing a metal helmet. It also possessed metal claws and had glowing red eyes. The most peculiar thing surrounding the sightings of the Monkey Man was the creature's strange ability to change form. Eyewitnesses reported that the creature was able to grow up to 8 feet in size. The creature seemed to have a strange fascination with buildings. Once inside the buildings, the Monkey Man would begin clawing and attacking its victims before fleeing out the window. Though police would later claim the incident was nothing more than mass hysteria, Others claim that the creature had killed more than three people during its attacks, and had even thrown a man off of the roof of a building that it was leaping from. Given the vast amount of witnesses surrounding the incident, people still believe that the creature was a genuine encounter that the police have failed to explain. Bigfoot Captured on Trail Camera This photograph was captured by a trail camera. Many people have come forward and suggested that it could be a humanoid unknown as the Tennessee Wildman. One of the first reports of the Tennessee Wildman goes back to the 1800s. It's said that a man running a circus was made aware of one of these creatures. Two men had managed to capture one and tried to sell it to the circus. It's reported that he was interested as he had never seen anything like it before. He eventually bought the beast and started to put it on display. However, not long after having it, the creature soon escaped and was never seen again. The description of the Tennessee Wild Man is similar to Bigfoot. It's said to stand between 6 and 9 feet tall and is covered in thick brown hair. Although some have compared it to Bigfoot, it's said to look more humanoid, having facial features that look more similar to modern day humans. It's perhaps best known for its loud cries that can be heard from miles away. Various hunters have reported hearing this loud noise while out hunting and they say it's unlike anything they've heard before. Researchers and hunters have said you know when you're near one because of the bad smell it gives off. It's been compared similarly to that of a skunk. The creature is said to be more confident than Bigfoot. It's very aggressive towards humans, and some have reported fleeing from areas as they've been charged by the animal. Those who have looked into the reports have said that it has a strange obsession with dogs and women. Many women have come forward and reported that a giant hairy man has tried to chase them into a nearby forest. They all report that it looked nothing like a human and was at least 8 feet tall. Various dogs have gone missing and when the owners went looking for them, all that could be found was large footprints. It's not known what the creatures are, but hunters have suggested that these large humanoids exist in several large groups suggesting further that they mainly live deep within the forest areas of the United States and are rarely seen by humans. So what do you make of these strange reports? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and help us by growing this community whilst working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.